We begin with breaking news right now, a major sign that the worst of the pandemic may be behind us. California ending its mask mandate. Governor Newsom just made that announcement saying our COVID cases have finally fallen enough. Eyewitness News reporter Jory Rand joins us live with the very latest. Jory. Ellen, Colleen, this sounds like a really big deal, and it is, but it might not be as big a deal as it sounds at first. Back in December of last year, the state saw that Omicron was exploding in cases, and so they implemented that order. They put it in place that masks had to be required in all indoor settings in public. It was set to expire February 15th. That's one week from tomorrow. Today, Governor Newsom announcing he's going to let it expire. That means in counties that don't have their own mask mandate in place, you will no longer have to wear that mask indoors in most public settings. Now, this does not apply right now to L.A. County, who has their own mandate, and they have said recently they plan to keep it in place beyond next week. We'll see if that holds now that the state has moved. But a large portion of you watching us, those in Orange County and the Inland Empire, this is you. Exceptions to this rule, if you are unvaccinated, if you have yet to get your shots, you will still need to wear a mask indoors, although that means businesses will have to check vaccination status. So in practice, we'll have to believe it's highly unlikely that is going to happen in most scenarios, but that will be the rule. Also, masks will be required in high risk settings like mass transit or in nursing homes. This also does not apply to schools. Kids in school will still need to wear a mask. The state has hinted they will look into changing that uh, soon as well. So why is this happening now? Well, the numbers are all going in the right direction, except for deaths at the moment. Those are expected to drop as well. But hospitalizations across Southern California are down nearly 50 percent in L.A. County over the last two and a half weeks since reaching the Omicron peak. They are down about 42 percent. That's down in just the last two and a half weeks. In Orange County, they are down 50% in the last two and a half weeks. And caseloads and um, testing percentage positivity rates across Southern California are all down right now. So that is the good news as we emerge from this second winter surge we have been in. Again, if you are vaccinated, you are largely safe from hospitalization and even more so when it comes to death. But the unvaccinated are still the majority of those in the hospital, the majority, the vast majority of those dying. And this mask rule will still apply to you if you have yet to get your vaccines indoors in public. We'll see how this changes, especially in L.A. County.